This is a patient of mine, mid-30s, with uh, bilateral shoulder uh, aching, uh, TLC deficit. And I, I worked on all of his uh, major muscles and um, with dry needling, not very much improvement. So we th I think I, we've pinpointed it to this, this, this uh, posterior deltoid. So I'm going to uh, wet needle it with a little sweetener in there. Pinch. Now I used to see the twitch. I used to get excited about that, but that's random. It's there. I cannot say anything about it. Anytime you hit a muscle in a certain location, it'll twitch. It doesn't mean anything. It's just random. That twitch response is a fallacy. It's unreal. You stimulate, now that's a little tough right there. You okay? Your eyeballs instantly had? No. Okay, 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 okay. So basically, I, I'm mincing up the muscle. Until it softens. This guy is so dense, he's made of Kevlar. There are certain groups of people who have Kevlar in their DNA and their muscles are just so densely packed that a thin needle can't ignite enough mother nature. So you need the hypodermic needle. If you don't have the hypodermic needle, you can't help them. If you don't have the hypodermic needle, you can't help them. You can try, but you can't help them. Just kind of pull that across and see how it feels. So once you release it, you stretch it out and Quieter? Quieter. Okay, 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 okay. So I've put enough holes in them today. You can't drink any water for a few hours. It'll just leak out. Okay. The um, So he's going to heat stretch massage, heat stretch massage. He's got his bars and balls. He'll work on them. And then Mother Nature will heal him. If he needs to come back, he will. Otherwise, he knows what to do. Thank you.